Hello, good morning. Welcome back to Profiting Diary. My name is Tiny. If you're not already subscribed, click on that subscribe button. Click that notification bell so you know when I'm live. Welcome back to all my returning subscribers. I love you guys. My day ones, those who comment, like, subscribe, comment below. And let me know, what are you doing this Saturday? It's a beautiful Saturday. What are you doing? I'm going to go out to a festival today and uh, enjoy myself. I wanted to got you guys to know within four years of me being here, I've never had technical issues with my website, but I knew that this month was special. I knew that those 101 calls were going to get you guys so many breakthroughs. PD Society Circle tomorrow will be talking about generational curses. Of course, Satan is mad, but it's fixed now. Go sign up. Let's get you free. Let's get those breakthroughs. Also, $20 off all calls. Hashtag spring me to get that coupon code. I mean, that is the coupon code. Today, my mug reads, love is patient, love is kind. <laughs> love is patient, love is kind. And we're talking a lot about love this month of April here at Prophetic Diary. Actually, this morning, the Lord showed me 1111. And I honestly haven't been seeing 1111 um, a lot lately, or maybe I just, he has not been revealing it to me like he used to but this morning he did and I knew that it was for you guys so actually this is going to be a two-part word this word is for my faithful ones and then I have another word word which is more of a warning so let's get into this word here the Lord gave me 11 11 this morning when I woke up and seen a vision and I'm like God what is this all about? What are you trying to say to me? And the Lord revealed to me that we are in transition. Just like the leaves in the fall fell off the tree, went into the ground and fermented the ground to prepare us for spring, right? Now these beautiful flowers are able to grow in the spring because of what happened in the fall, right? Everything fell off, went into the ground and prepared it. God is saying, you're going to see some things sprout out of the ground, like these beautiful flowers that were once in the ground, but behind me, they're going to sprout up. You are going through a transition. You are going through a transformation and you are going to sprout up. Psalms 11, 11. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for his mercy endures forever. To him, which divided the Red Sea into part. For his mercy endures forever. But the part about him dividing the Red Sea, because the miracles that you are going to see transform and come in your love life. Some of you, your love life is in a transition, a transition right now. It is transforming. Trust me, it is transforming. That's why it's going to be so sudden because it's happening under the ground. It's happening. It's transforming under the ground. The things that happen under the ground in the winter, we don't see till the spring. I'm preaching to someone. I'm trying to let you know. 11-11, it's like two people standing next to each other. If you put it on its side, it's an equal sign. Two equals marriage, 11-11. Think about it, right? The Lord gave me this for you. And to which him who divided the rest, he... That same God divided the red that divided the red sea is concerned about your kingdom marriage, has love waiting for you. And a lot of people are saying, Tiny, these words are so hard to believe. And I know they are family, because you're so used to abuse, you're so used to abandonment, orphan, rejection. You know, you can't believe that a love like this has come for you. But it has, and you have to believe it. But it's okay. I'm your coach. I'll encourage you. I'll get you there. I'll blow the whistle when needed. I'll push you when needed. Don't worry. Um, but yeah, he says, oh, give thanks. Give thanks. It's transitioning. It's growing. It's going to sprout up. It's going to sprout up and you're going to be able to see the transition, see a blossom, see a bloom. And it's going to be gorgeous. It's going to be beautiful. But know that your spouse 
is coming out of hiding, coming out of darkness, coming out of a past relationship, coming out of some insecurities, coming out of yesterday, coming out of some fears. There's a transition happening underground, and it's just going to spout up for you. 1111 family, I love you. Whatever 11, what does 1111 mean to you? What has God revealed to you about 1111? It is not angel numbers. We don't get into angel numbers here. That is witchcraft, right? That's people coming up with all types of stuff and all this other stuff. But what did God reveal to you? Jeremiah 11, 11, all these different Psalms of love. But what did he reveal to you about the number 11, 11? If you feel led to so into his word, hashtag 11, 11. Talk to you guys soon. Sign up for that one on one. Hope to see you guys tomorrow on the Peanut Society, Society Circle. It is going to be amazing. Please sign up. Talk to you soon. One love.